So Marvel finally decides to kill somebody off, and they're dead for good. Hey guys, thank you for joining the quest. Hey guys, thank you for joining the quest. Marquise Underwood here to review Avengers Age of Ultron, directed by Josh Reading, starring Chris Evans, Robert Downey Jr. Okay, so the premise of this movie is that Tony Stark finds this program which he believes can jumpstart the program that he's already working on called Ultron. And when the program works, it finds out that it works for evil. And so basically, Tony Stark's made this bad thing that's attacking the Avengers in the world. This movie was great. The action scenes were on point. I really enjoyed the Iron Man versus Hulk scene. I thought that was done really well. Um, the scene at the end where all of them joined together, I thought that was really well too. The scene showed a great sense of unity too. A lot of times, two of the group members would join forces just to do one attack, like a combo move. So I really enjoy that. It showed their unity. All right, so Scarlet Witch and Quicksilver in the movie too. I kind of felt like they didn't really need to be in the movie. Um, they were just kind of there for me. You know, Quicksilver with Days of Future Past coming out last year. It kind of hurt him because he basically seen his stuff already. So it was really nothing new. And Scarlet Witch, she was just there for me. You know. I noticed that Quicksilver had a stronger accent than Scarlet Witch, even though they're brothers and sisters, but they're really twins. So I didn't really know how that worked. I think that kind of worked against them somewhat. Visions in the movie too. I thought he was done really well. I really enjoyed Ultron though. He is basically the meat of this movie. And I must say he doesn't disappoint at all. Um, the guy is very funny. A lot of comic relief. He's very dark, but he's really funny too. I really enjoyed that. You know, to me, he's probably the best villain in the whole MCU. I don't, I don't really care for Loki. I think he's kind of there. He's not really necessary. It's not really like a threat to them per se, but um, I really did like Ultron. I didn't really go into this movie trying to compare it to the first Avengers movie, because you have to let that movie just stand alone just because it's the first time you ever seen five superheroes on the same, you know, movie. So you just have to let that be. I thought this movie was great as a standalone. It was possibly better than the first movie to me. So um, that's, that's always a plus. I'm giving this movie an A+. Plus. I'm feeling a 4.8. Um, it probably would have gotten a 5 if it wasn't for the twins. So guys, have you seen Avengers Age of Ultron? If you have, let me know. Comment below. Subscribe to my channel, please. Share it.